Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. I'm so excited for some reason about this. Oh no, it's not this again! No, wait, what? No! What the hell is this already? Another... what? Some kind of Metroid presenting here? Is this what I'm seeing? Truly, ISO? You're playing this again? Metroid 3? But did we not just play it a few months ago? Perhaps. Perhaps not. Maybe it was an illusion. But yes. Super Metroid Ice Metal Uninstall. I, I don't know what the uninstall is about, but... Ice Metal version 1.3, I think. So yes, let's begin, shall we? No data? Well, let's go ahead and create some data for me. The last Metroid is in 1994. Oh, I think I pressed, like, the freaking... I get confused as to the controls in this game. Did I press the right thing right now? Is this the right thing? Nope! <laughs> Which is the right button to press here? This works. Let's just press that. <laughs> oh no, wait, is this... Did my control save? I hope so. If not, then we're screwed. Planet Zabizabub. Well, let's get started, shall we? Um, start, I guess. I think I have it mapped wrong. You know, I didn't have it mapped wrong before. But here we are! Wow, that's a pretty awesome looking ship. Well, look at my energy. It's all wiggly and, <laughs> and happy and 99. Okay, so... Yes, my controls didn't save for whatever reason, so... Give me a minute, I gotta remap them again. And there we go. This should be right. So wow, I'm a nice snazzy blue color and there's fog and mist everywhere and we're just gonna kind of go around. Oh, look, a tree thing. We are in the Alps! Oh, I don't have... Wait, do I have any special powers? Oh, I mean, my power beam is blue, I just noticed that. So do I have any special... No, I am... I'm completely lackluster in terms of special abilities. Well, that's fine by me. My ship looks freaking radical, so I don't really mind. It's it's all blood red and bathed in blood. Blood is everywhere. Although th this seems like a much pleasanter start than Eris was. There's not a whole lot of death and doom. So let's just begin, shall we? Blowing up a little pipe. Nope, there is nothing in the pipe. But I can walk around in this maze-like environment, looking at more pipes, investigating. I am as if I was a plumber. Like Mario, perhaps, except there's a wall background here. Can I climb it in spider form? But uh, I don't think there's spider form in this game. I could wall jump to get up there, but I think I should refrain from wall jumping until I, I deem it necessary. Which could be later, could be later. I, I should probably just like shoot around, make sure there's no hidden upgrades. Okay, it doesn't really look like it yet, but here we are! Wow, this fog is really impairing my vision, is it not? Is this a, is this a thing? I'm falling! <laughs> I don't know where I'm falling, but I'm in a place now. Oh, looks like I need some kind of waterworks to go in there. And by waterworks, I of course mean the morph ball. So, a new adventure begins anew. Oh man, I really like the new door designs. Yeah, this hack has a lot of new graphics. Ice Metal did a good job with making new graphics so far, it seems. Although, I just sort of walked into the morph ball. <laughs> yes! The design seems to be quite similar to the original at this point in time. I just fell through this thing. Uh, I guess I was supposed to go here. <laughs> I just sort of thought, maybe I should shoot down and thus... Ooh, a thing! Ooh, I, I, but I see a thing there, I want the thing. I, I mean, you can't just show me a thing and say, nope, you can't have that thing. No, I, I want the... Th Can I get to the thing if I shoot this? Um, hmm. Thing! I don't know how to get that yet, so I guess... I will just be crying a whole lot until I find... No, my beautiful, beautiful... Ooh, flashing and brilliance. I like the graphics. <laughs> I really do. I enjoy the palettes, too, already. Like, it looks neat. Uh-oh. I gotta do some fancy jumps here. Uh-oh! Shriek bats! Except they're not. Ah! Wait, get back here. Get back here. Oh, yeah, I forgot to tell you the story. I have it in a TXT over here. Basically, we're on planet Nerian 3, I think, or something. And maybe it will be explained later and I'm spoiling you, but I think because the story's in the text file that it's uh, not actually going to be in-game. So maybe that's a thing. So we're on Nerian 3. This planet is too hostile, so we're here to destroy an Aurora unit. And that is a thing. Oh, I think that capsule... Might be a Metroid capsule? Yeah, I think it is. Or, or a 
a Chozo capture. We got the bombs though. We got we got the freaking bombs already, so we can explode ourselves. Oh no! I wonder what's going to happen. Oops! I think I I messed up something. Oh no! It's Torizo's shoe. Come on, Torizonto! Let's bomb your legs. I don't think I can actually. You are immune to leg bombing, but that's okay. Ah! Missile time! I want you dead! Well, my missiles are like blue or something. That's pretty awesome. Okay, so we're, we're out of missiles. Oops, and I'm, I'm not remembering how to play this, apparently. Dang it, Snow! Give me health! I'm gonna die on the first boss, probably. That's how I roll, man. Oh no, you're spewing your spawn over there, but I want to shoot it. Let me shoot your spawn! Don't let the spawn be shot by you. You're facing the wrong way if you want to give me health, so please... Well, I, I suppose if you were smart, you would continue doing it that way, but... No, please, stop being intelligent about this. Dang it! <laughs> You're facing the wrong way that is not useful to me. Ugh. Hmm. You seem to... Were you always taking this many hits to kill? I seem to remember you being a fairly easy boss, but I think you are changing colors a bit there. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Calm down, buddy. Don't don't just backstab like that. Or, or not backstab, per se, but uh, bounce back. I think Chozos have beaks, and that's why this guy has like a beak, and now his heart is coming out of his skin there. Don't look at the heart, kids, or you will lose your heart itself. He will reach into your stomach and pull it right out of there. I don't know why you ate your heart, but uh, it's in your stomach now, so just be warned. My goodness, sir. Sir, you take quite a while to kill. Your face is yellow. Well, I, I don't know. Your eye is yellow. Is that Well, your, most of your face is your eye. I mean, I can't really distinguish much more than that besides that beak. Oh, well, now you don't even have a head. Well, way to go there, buddy. <laughs> You're just the headless, beakless friend now. Um, oh, I probably shouldn't hang around there. Ugh! Oh no! I'm gonna die! <laughs> Please don't die, because... That would be kind of embarrassing, actually. Uh, okay, just go between his legs. Go between his legs and all will be fine. All will be fine. All will be fine, in theory. Dang it, dude. Just stay in your corner or something. I'm kind of afraid to get up and attack you now. Just stay there. Turn around. Okay. <laughs> kind of got me in a panic there, but I think, I think I'm all right now. I think I'm... <laughs> Okay, so, a uh, close call on the first boss, but <laughs> I think we're doing fine. I think we're okay. So, maybe I should check out the map, see where I am. Oh, I'm on the surface. Still on the surface. So yeah, this game is apparently more uh, exploration-based than the original game was. Super Metroid, Super Metroid, so I guess that's kind of a plus for me because... Yeah, I, I kind of like the exploration stuff, so uh, it's going to be a fun time, and we're all going to have a lot of fun yelling at me when I don't know where to go, and that's always pretty great, too. I don't have uh, the spring ball yet, so that's not a thing I have, so I don't know why I, I mentioned it since I don't have it. Ugh! Okay, so upwards, I guess, is where I need to go now. Fine by me, but uh, yeah, how do I get that thing there? Maybe Oh, bombs, bombs. That's right, I have bombs. Bombs can... Oh, I need a... That's, uh, that's probably Super Metroid, yeah, okay. Super, wait, <laughs> Super Missiles. Yeah, this is Super Metroid. Yeah, uh, anyway. <laughs> I don't know what I'm saying, but that's fine, I guess. So, yeah, we didn't explore over here. There's a, a thing blocking the way. Do I need to blow it up? Yes, I do, but what about the rest of the surface? I, I kind of want to go explore the rest of the surface, unless I couldn't. I mean, I probably couldn't, but I didn't notice, but I kind of want to go back and see. Maybe save now that I've got my missiles and my bombs and all the good things that I need to survive that I would be lacking. How did I... What the... Wait a minute, what the heck <laughs> happened to causality? Oh, did I actually, like... Oh, I'm stupid, I think. Or, oh, I needed, like, more... Oh, my God, I cannot freaking figure out what the hell is happening to me. <laughs> so, yes, now that we have stuff, I can get places now. Hooray, and my ship is pretty radical. I can go inside of it. My ship looked like it's smaller than I am in terms of height, but I guess most cars are like that, aren't they? Samus can sit down while inside of her own motorized vehicle, even if it is a floating vehicle. So, where was there a thing I needed to morph ball over here? Yes and no. What? Oh, I Oh, speed boost blocks. Oh, I like the new graphics. <laughs> So I can go up here if I wanted to, but why would I want to go this way? I, does this still lead to the wrecked ship, or does this lead elsewhere? How do I, how do I obtain that object? Hmm, need the speed, I see. Okay, so I guess that's for that upgrade there. 
fine, and up there is just nothingness. There's a tree there. There's a also a crumbly brock, brock there. Why is there a brock there? I don't know. Let us keep exploring to the east. Ooh, I like the little tunnel there. <laughs> it's kind of a weirdly shaped tunnel. Uh-oh. What? Where have I ended up? Oh, we're in the jungle. Look at these graphics. It looks like s <laughs> straight out of like a Mario hack or something. That's awesome. <laughs> Look at this little b donut bridge here. <laughs> this is already so awesome. Whoa, what the <laughs> Subterrane. I gotcha. Look at these barrels. <laughs> This is so, uh, like, dare I say, adorable? <laughs> Probably. <laughs> Let's just walk across the barrels and crumble jungle here. This is so... I love this. This is... This is just freaking... <laughs> I am already in love with this game, and it is only the first day... Oh, now we are in the surface again. Okay, so I've gone from the jungles, to the spike forest, to the barrel house with skulls, to the surface yet again. Uh-oh, crabs. Ah, oh, gotta get out of the crabs. Crabs take forever to kill early on, so I don't know. I might just leave you be there, guy. I have no idea where I'm going at this point in time, so, uh, yes. Oh, whoopsie! Where have I gone? Off to jump correctly, Samus. I'm used to the games such as uh, other, other games, like the Zero Mission, I guess. A bit more than Super Metroid. So I have some fumbling with the controls, but oh my, yeah, this is definitely based on exploration. If I'm already somewhere and I have no idea how to get back, so. <laughs> um, hmm, you got a gun? No, I've got a gun. You have a. You have a very good vantage point there, Mr. Uh, thing, although I think I have just found your weakness. You cannot come to this little corner up here. So what is inside this alcove? A hidden thing? Nothing. This. Okay, is this. Just a little alcove for that guy, maybe? Hmm. Maybe an upgrade hidden in the ceiling? I don't think so. I actually have no freaking idea where I am now. Uh, I already said that, didn't I? Well, it's it remains to be true. So I can either go in this door, or I think I could go down. If I go down, there's pillars and stuff and crumbly blocks. That seems promising. Can I get in there? I can if I do a double bomb jump, but maybe... Uh, oh, there's water down there. Eh, let's not go to the water. The water water is not my friend, basically. It, it doesn't seem like it would help me very much, and I can't really move around in it, so let's just avoid that if we can. Jump! Ah, yes. Yeah, I will be using wall jumps just to aid me, but... Well, I, I don't know how required it is, so until I know whether it's required or not, I will not be using it on a regular basis, pretty much. So, Mr. Krabs, you've got three eyes there, but two of them are golden, while the last one is golden rod, so just be careful. Don't get your colors mixed up. Do not mix those things up. I can probably get inside here, I, I think. Yeah, blowing up stuff. So the crumbly block blocks are actually visible. Usually you can't see those, so it's nice to see that... Oh no! What's happening? Uh, I think that was my computer. I don't know why it would do that, but I thought the game froze. <laughs> so I thought I patched the game wrong or something, but I think I think we're fine. I think we're fine for now at least. Uh, I hope saving works in this game, just in case I will put a save state uh, when I get to the next save, I guess, when I will probably end up the part since... I've been playing for a fairly decent amount for one episode, but uh, exploring the ice caps here. Not finding much, though. I really like how there's snow here, but not here, because it's covered by the thing. That's... <laughs> I like that. <laughs> and, uh, attention to detail is a nice thing to have. Uh-oh, we're in the freaking rainstorm area now that's in a cave. Ah, some giant behemoth of a monster is burping all over the place and it's creating a giant mist <laughs> that's enveloping the cave. Uh, hello there, Mr. Stingray Puddles. I'm going to die unless I am careful. Okay, let's try to live. So maybe I should use my missiles a little bit more often. Trapezoids there seem quite deadly, but oh, if I have this vantage point, like, why should I waste ammunition? Why should I? Though so that guy, maybe. Trapezoid, you're dead, but you there. Jump up! I dare you! Yes, gotcha, you fiend. And so missiles restore too, that's pretty typical. The loading screen continues, and now, like, where am I even? I'm just exploring the surface, apparently. Uh, oh, spikes. That's dangerous. 
So I could go. I wonder. I don't know if wall jumps are re required, actually. I mean, I can go up here, but uh, I don't think I will. At least not yet. Uh, we'll just fall down this endless passage. Why not? <laughs> Into a watery spiked demise. Have we achieved Dung Rot's bottom? Uh, by that I meant something else, but I kind of forgot the name of it. What's his name? Jolly Rod? No. I freaking Davy Jones Locker. That <laughs> I don't know why I couldn't remember that of all things, but uh, there we go. We are in a place that I consider that apparently. Oh, uh, there's got to be secrets abound here. Oh, shouldn't they? But I can get up there or something. Maybe not. Oh, maybe. Uh, uh yes, I can. But this leads to. Oh, wait, this is probably like the required path anyway. Sometimes I just <laughs> accidentally find things that are correct because they look suspicious. I think this is another one of those cases. Okay, there's a tree here. Trees cannot be blown up, and they, they kind of look like a Super Mario World unused tile with a hole inside of it. Um, so, upwards we climb, but where exactly am I going here? What is that? Ah! Oh, you are a spawner of Cretans, I see. Um, where am I? <laughs> Oh, a thing! Uh, can I access that, please? Oh, I'm on the opposite side of a place, but... Oh, I... My guess is I need to get inside that? To get that, but to get that, then... Can I blow this up or anything? No, not yet, at least. How about over here? Aha! A passage! Ha ha ha! Secrets cannot be hidden from me! For very long, at least. And just a missile. Alright, so we've got ten missiles. We've got, uh getting lost pretty much and we got stuff. This game is starting out in a way that I really enjoy so I'm really pleased that I'm playing it although there's a guy kind of stuck in there sometimes so you gotta take a hit. That's fine though. That's just fine. Taking hits is part of the Metroid experience after all. If you can take a hit then you can probably survive getting hit if you, if you know what I mean. Like a hitman or something? I don't know. So I need the vaporization tool in order to continue or I can hitch a ride on this guy I guess. Don't ram your face into the wall, it's probably not good for your health, Mr. I've got blue flame spurting out of my butt. So this might just be a shortcut. You, you use the grapple beam to get over here. Where is here? Like, I am not sure, but it could be a shortcut, wherever it is that I am going. Just sort of waiting for a save point to appear at this point. <laughs> but, uh, nonetheless, I am excited. Ooh, a little small tunnel here. <laughs> Let us keep going, I guess, until the ends of the earth. What is this? Maybe I... Oh, power bombs. Oh, that makes sense, because they're yellow. Okay. Gotcha. You do make sense, game. I'm missing a... Like, a ton of stuff. <laughs> like, a ton of stuff is there to be explored, and I really like that fact. That I can go to, like, a million places, and still have places to go. Just love that idea. Just... Whoa, 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 what is this thing? What have I just found? Boost, wait, what? Boost ball? What? Boost ball? Boost ball? Boost ball? Is that the same as spring ball? I guess so. Okay, well, I just found the spring ball, apparently. <laughs> That's fine, I always wondered why it was, like, present so late in the original game, but there we go. Uh, not entirely sure what to do with my newfound ball ability, but... Uh, it seems that it works hella well underwater, or maybe, hmm, maybe the underwater physics were improved so you can jump higher? Not entirely sure, but heck, I, I just found it, so <laughs> whatever, I could probably make it into there now, or I can go up here and make it over here. Okay, I got what you mean. I got what you want me to do, but I, I, I really would like to find a way back at this point. Ah, uh, get me on the thing! Oh my god, spikes do a hell of a lot of damage. I don't want to die. <laughs> I need a health regen thing, please. Uh, I hope there's no spikes down here. Okay, good. Uh, oh, that's a power bomb barrier? Okay, so I found not yet, but soon we shall find more, I assume. So I need to go heal at the little dudes down here. There is a dude farm here. Thank you for sharing. I need more of your delicious victuals. Okay, wow, small health heal a lot in this game. Wow, okay, so that's generous. Very generous of you, game maker. Oh, oops, I didn't really want to fall there. Okay, I think I only have one option to go here, and that is 
left. So let us go left and discover what is here. Could be a dead end. I'm thinking it's a dead end. Well, unless there's something down over here. Is there a thing? Well, yes, there is an E-Tank. Oh, yeah. First E-Tank acquired. It's only in the first episode, although one could argue this should be not the f- Whoa, what? Oh, freaking- No, I didn't mean to fall all the way down here. Can the boost ball jump me all the way up there? Can I wall jump upwards? Is the boost ball really good at going up? The underwater physics seem to be slightly tweaked. Is it just my imagination or not? Don't know for sure. Definitely want to get up to that door, though. It's got to have, like, a save behind it or something. Like, where where am I? I'm, like, way over here. There's got to be something there. There's just got to be something over there. And that's the way I came. That's right. Okay. So, yeah, let's not fall off this time and be smart about this. Use a little technique I like to call, I'm using a shortcut. And go in the door. Uh, where am I ending up? I don't know, but I think if I fall down here, I will soon fall low enough that I will end up here. Okay, so this will take me back to my ship where I can finally end off the part in, in theory. I could just use spring ball, or boost ball as it is known. I wonder if there's another ability of the... Wait a minute. I can hold down the run button as boost ball and it seems to actually function as the boost ball like wait a minute yes it does it makes me go faster I think oh wow that's oh it does holy whoa okay so speeding using the boost ball may be a tactic to use to get places perhaps maybe can the boost ball destroy those speedo blocks that is a question. Can I blow this up? Maybe with Boosty I can. Can I? Can I? No, I don't... Well, I wouldn't think so. No, I don't think... Okay. So that's nothing. But yes, the Boost Ball actually functions as the Boost Ball. I didn't actually expect that. But now that I know that this hack has like a lot of ASM stuff going on, it would seem... I'm even more elated to play it. Oh my god, this seems like a really, really good hack so far. Okay, so just to make sure, I will put a save state, and we'll find out next time whether the save works, and continue playing. Planet Nerian 3, or the third, it's Roman numeral style, so who knows. See you guys next time, for when we continue the adventure. I already got like, three or four upgrades, wow. Pretty quick, pretty quick, see you guys then.